Hello, these are my hands. All right, so you don't have to see my face for this one video. I'm going to spare you that. So in this video, what we're going to do is we're going to talk about the project that we would be building in the next couple of videos. All right, so I just want to give you a quick explanation, a quick a diagram of how the website is going to look like so that what I want to do is after this video I want you to go out and try it on your own right in the next videos obviously we're going to discuss how to build that project but try it on your own if you figure it out incredible if you don't I'm always there to help you but either way if, even if you figure it out or not I would definitely recommend to watch the next couple of videos because we are going to discuss a lot more in those videos I'm going to add a lot to the information that we've been talking up until now for example I'm also going to talk to you about why do we need dog type HTML the first thing that we see right when we one second dog type HTML do you remember this this is something that we see in every single first line of our Visual Studio Code uh, index.html basically that right we see this particular line in every first line of our index.html all right why do we need this and i'm going to talk a lot more about some more uh, additional elements that we that we are seeing in the recent videos in the index.html all right so i would definitely recommend to watch the next couple of videos even if you figured it out but perfect so let's get started so i'm going to give you a quick explanation about what the website is going to look like so now you can try it on your own firstly the website needs to have a massive heading it should say my favorite tv shows so i just want to build a website to kind of like showcase my favorite tv shows you can uh, say your favorite anime you can say your favorite movies you can say your favorite places food anything that you want all right so the website title is going to look something like this and right down uh, below the title i want to have a small subtitle or a sub or a paragraph i just want to kind of like you know say this website is the property of vamshi krishna something like that all right so just a small line just to indicate or to add some more information to the title below this i want to have a list all right a list of all the topics or all the items that we have inside the website for example if we are building something around the tv shows i just want to have the names of all the tv shows all right but here's the catch in this list if i click on this particular element for example let's just say this tv show is the office right if i click on this particular thing if i click on this text i want to be navigated to an entirely new page which is going to contain only the information about the office simple enough all right so you're going to have a list of tv shows something like this and below that uh, you're going to have a image and the name of the tv show the exact name of this tv show for example if it is the office it's going to be the office and below this you can add something like parks and recreation something like that so all the three or four or how many ever tv shows that you want to add first i need a list of all of them it's kind of like a navigation bar in multiple websites whenever i click on one of these i want to be navigated to that particular website and below i just want to be i just want you to show me those particular tv shows or items using images and text but one more small catch it doesn't matter if i click the image it doesn't matter if i click this title i should still be navigated to this particular page all right so this page can be navigated by three different places one by clicking the title one by clicking the image and one by clicking this one all right so if you can if you don't know something or if you're uh, unable to figure out some things you can always go back to and watch our previous lectures previous videos and they should be they should be enough to help you but if you don't figure it out we already have a solution coming up so in the next video we're going to start building it i'm going to explain to you what uh, doc type html is and a lot more other elements inside the index.html all right so build this try it out if you don't get it i'm here if you get it incredible good job perfect awesome i'll see you in the next video